Hi, Mr. Young here. Now, what is it that makes a PowerPoint suddenly become an interactive multimedia product? Let's take a look. In this example, a student's created a guide to Vienna. So, what have we got? One very nice big background picture, clear indication of what the site's about, welcome to Vienna, and an invitation to just click on this hyperlink to begin and it takes us to an introduction to Vienna. Now in what sense is it multimedia? Well we've got text here, we've got pictures, the thing that's missing, just click here, I hope you heard that, um, it's sound. Now the way that's been done is to embed a sound file into the slide and make it automatically play when the slide shows. So it's multimedia because we've got text, pictures and sound and it's interactive because the end user can see from this menu here where they want to go just by clicking. Now in the next presentation I'm going to show you how this actually got made but it's really just a series of PowerPoint slides and pictures have been dragged in, text have been dragged in and these links created. So, I hope that's given you a good idea of what an interactive multimedia product can look like when created in PowerPoint.